What's up guys? So today is day three, El Salvador. We are in Playa El Tunco. We just drove all the way out here and about to see what we can get into. Playa El Tunco is one of the best, uh, like, well, it's one of the most touristy places in El Salvador. Lots of foreigners come here to relax, vacation, surf, eat good food, and explore El Salvador. So we're trying to uh, kind of check out what this is all about. Every time I've been to El Salvador, I've always kind of done what the locals do, never actually what the tourists do. So this is gonna be my first tourist experience here in El Salvador at Playa El Tunco. So I'm pretty excited. All right, so we're debating on getting a hotel room. So like, you know what, why don't we just stay here uh, for the day? So gotta check out some places and and see what's good. All right, so first place didn't work out too well. I mean, the price was really good, but it was like really small with like two beds, uh, just like a ceiling fan, and that wasn't ideal really for <laughs> three grown big dudes. So uh, we just got another one with four beds that I guess is for four different people, but it's like a hostel, but with a private room. So everyone gets a bed, there's hammocks, there's uh, like just a shared kitchen where you know you can make coffee, make food, whatever. It's right on the water, private parking, AC, Wi-Fi. It's really all you need. So uh, not only that, it's 30 bucks a night. So we're only splitting it two ways. It's still 15 bucks a person, 24 hours. You can rent surfboards. Uh, so yeah, I mean, you can't beat that. That's total you know, kind of relaxation, just chilling out on the beach. So definitely worth it. Check this out. So we just got a surfboard. Do not know how to surf. Actually, don't even know how to swim really. But so this isn't even going to be probably that great of an idea. But hey, you know what? When you are in on vacation, right? You just got to say, fuck it. We just set everything up. So now we're heading to the water. Finally, at last. So let's check out this view. Pretty stoked right now. So we checked out the beach, the water was warm, lots of rocks, so it's not like where you can just pop up your seat in your tent, chill out on the sand. That's not gonna happen. It's just all rock. So either wear shoes or just tough it out barefoot because like where the water breaks, there is sand, it's black volcanic sand. Um, but other than that, it's just all rocks that you're gonna have to walk on. So we took the surfboard, decided it was not a good idea to take it out there because I was like, well, maybe it's going to be flat. No, those waves were pretty big, so there's no way I was going to do that. So we just gave it right back. So we're just walking around the corner. Uh, we're about to get some food, and then we're just going to kind of keep exploring. Um, camarones en espinaca con queso. Esa es de camarón. Con queso y espinaca con queso. Yeah. Y ese es dos revueltas con una de camarón con queso. I got the same thing as he did. Mm -hmm. Antonio, ¿por qué no necesitas un poco de pork? Sí, no. Es como yo. ¿Quieres un poco de pork? ¿Cuánto te gusta? Oh, they're good. good. The cheese are good. Alright, so those pupusas are pretty good. All of that with the beers so was only $9.50. So for under $10, bucks, you can feed three people and drink so it can't beat that about to uh get some shots here so three shots jose cuervo three pilsners you know what just a little strip right here looks kind of dope we're just gonna chill out maybe bar hop a little right by the beach man yeah, SBC. Got a couple of craft beers here. El Salvador is coming up with the craft beers. C Bob. This is a, their version of craft is artisan, so artisanal beers. It is their version of craft beers. So we're gonna try this also. 
Okay, this is the way that we're going to take this shot. First of all, cheers, people. Hey, cheers. Cheers. Okay. You know what? Cheers. I'm just going to down the hatchet. Cheers. Cheers. Let's watch this guy do it. Thank you, Rachel Lemon. Okay. Yeah. Oh, the sauce. sauce. Hey. This is the Mexican style, guys. All right, so for me, I just take it and then, boom. No salt, no lime. On to the next one, right? And this is how you're supposed to chase it down, like this. And before, you, chase the beer. and before you stop the video, I just want to say this is the way I teach my two sons how to drink. <laughs> <laughs> So we got the bananas and cocos. Los cocos se dan casi todo el tiempo, verdad? Cocos is all, all the way. So here we are, Playa El Look at this place. It's just magical. Cheers. This is views for days. Oh my god. It's that famous rock right there, Playa El Tunco. If you check it out on Instagram or YouTube, you'll always see this rock. We're right here, right in front of it, right now in person. Pretty sick. It's gigantic. Oh, look, he just got his shoes wet. Whoa! Wow. I know you guys can't tell on camera, but it's actually raining right now. It's kind of sprinkling, but you can still see all the surfers right here coming out, hitting the turf, and just hitting those waves. Actually, we should have probably brought the surfboard out here. It was a little bit calmer. Not saying we would have done it, but you know, I would have felt more confident. Check yeah. out this, uh, oh look. It's going to taste Hold it on. They, so apparently you can drink this water. They, that's what they say, it's not salty. Then it's not salty, it's tasty. And it is true. It's true? No salt it's at all. Salty? Taste it. It's kind of... Can you taste salt? No. Oh shit. <laughs> no, you can't. No, no, no salt at all. Now I gotta check for, for myself. meters away from the, the edge of the beach. Oh, what? That is no salt. It's the same water. water that's coming from the ocean. It because does it's not taste like there's salt. The yeah. yeah, probably because it's being filtered from the rocks. That's true. Crazy though. And if you guys can tell, or if you guys, uh, if you guys can't tell, this is some some more of that black sand. The sand here is like a darker color because it's volcanic sand, so it takes on a darker color. Pretty cool. All right guys, so Playa del Tunco was super dope. So we just kind of hung out. We really just drank the majority of the day. I'm not even gonna lie to you guys, but we hung out, we chilled, we drank, we went to the beach, we got some food, and then we just left the next day. Um, yesterday, we didn't really do too much. We really kind of just stayed home all day. But today we are back at it again. We are at La Gran Villa, which is like one of the biggest shopping centers around here. Uh, very modern too, very modern look. Uh, so we're about to just kind of hang out, maybe get a beer, and uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for right now. Alright, so we just got these beers here. Everything is $1.50. So I thought it was just drinks, but now you can get burgers, breads, burritos, without alcohol, margaritas, beers. Mixed drinks, cocktails, everything is 150. Look at that. Everything at the same price. So it doesn't, everything is actually 150. Look the name of the game. So if you're here, you gotta come check this out. Look at this ambiance. We are on the. Oh, it's essentially like a Top of the bar. Um, what do you think? Tom Chat for the fish. From pupusa stands on almost every single corner to beautiful beaches to tire rim grills. 
The people of El Salvador do the absolute best with what they have on hand. With conditions not always being ideal and the struggle for the everyday dollar, the people in this country still remain some of the most passionate and hardworking people I've ever met in my entire life. It was a pleasure being able to come down here again this year to spend time with my family and to be able to share this experience with all of you. So a big thank you to you for watching this video. If you like it, go ahead and hit the thumbs up button, leave a comment down below and let us know if you've ever been to El Salvador before. And if you're not already subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and we'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.